Yeah, thank you very much, um, Pradeep, and uh, so Theo, nice to meet you. So I'm the sales manager for, for Dimo, um, for Dimo Mainz. I'm based in Mexico, um, and so today I'm going to showcase you a bit uh, so what we do uh, in Dimo and how do we uh, connect to Sage X3. Um, so first, I'm going to introduce um, rapidly the um, sort of firm, so who, who we are, so Dimo Mainz, we are part of uh, of Demo Software. So Demo Software, we are a bit more than 300 uh, employees. Um, we are a French company with their headquarters in Lyon. And um, one of uh, one activity of the group is Demo Main. So Demo Main, we are really focused on maintenance software. So CMMS software. It's been 20, 28 years that we are editor and, and integrator of. Uh, of this kind of software, we have currently 2,000 customers subscribed in a bit more than 100 countries. Uh, we have nine agencies, um, and two of them are on the Americas, one in Canada in Toronto, and then one in Mexico where I'm based. <clears throat> on those agencies, we have a consultant support, and so all of the services that are needed to, to have a great experience uh, with Demo uh, on the same time zone, okay? Also, if you have a project, a uh, one one, we will be able to to, to support you um, with a multi-language and uh, multicultural um, team, okay? So our solution, it's already traduced. So one very interesting thing for, for, for any Canadian company is that uh, so the software is in English, but also in French, okay? So you can, um, being on, on the same software, on the same database, you have, uh, for example, an uh, operation in Quebec and operation in Ontario, you can perfectly, um, Manage uh, manage it with some some users entering the software in French, some users entering it in English, and same thing. If you have also operation in Mexico, uh, we can perfectly support it in Spanish or in Portuguese in case in Brazil. Okay. Um, so first, um, what is a, a CMMS? No, uh, what is the added value? So the CMMS is, is uh, a computerized uh, maintenance management software. Um, so basically, it's here to help the maintenance team. Um, so first, simplify and secure the, the management of, uh, of of their operation. Okay. So the idea is that I will be able to to create some checklist, uh, secure the operation of my maintenance team when they are operating on, on the assets, and um, and have it very very simplified. No. Um, the idea is also to help organize and anticipate the maintenance. So you will be able to schedule all of your maintenance, preventive and corrective maintenance. Okay. Um, when I say preventive, so for example, on on your onto your plant, you have your, your production line. Okay. And you have, you have your assets, and for example, some assets uh, like your car, for example, every 5,000 kilometers. So for example, five five thousand hour, you will have to do that a specific type of of check or of maintenance onto the asset, same thing for example every month, every week, etc. Okay, and also corrective. So someone is working into the plant, or maybe the the production manager see there is a, a problem onto an, an asset, he will be able to raise a request. Okay, and so you will be able to analyze all of that and see which equipment are costing you the most. Um, see if you are getting better onto the reliability of your equipments. Um, see if uh, the, the performance of the subcontractors, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, so really the idea is analyze and optimize your maintenance. Um, so you will be able to, to manage your subcontractors also in case you, you need it and for sure uh, improve the interdepartmental communication. So the idea is that the production will be able to also to enter and you will be able to involve them into, into the software and um, better have a better communication between production and maintenance, for example. Okay, that could be the same thing with infrastructure if you want to manage it or maybe also the, the vehicles. Okay, and for sure um, ensure the Interoperability, interoperability, for example, uh, with Sage X3 in this case. Okay, I will go deeper into that uh, afterwards. Um, so some of the major gains um, that is bringing the CMMS um, within a, a manufacturing organization. Um, so first is the equipment availability. Okay, um, so the idea is that um, with a better maintenance, you will have a, a better av availability uh, of your assets and your production assets. Also, a better equipment life, okay, so it will be increased. Uh, we, 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 we think it can be up to 250%. Um, and for sure, um, reduce uh, the intervention time and reduce the work preparation for the maintenance team, okay. And by the end, it's also 
reduce the corrective works, okay? So with a better preventive plan and better preventive maintenance, you will have less um, fail on the assets and for sure less corrective maintenance, okay? And this is less cost also. Um, so now around the, the solution. So the solution is is for all um, in every type of industry, okay? Um, currently on and mainly on to the, on to the Americas, 90% of our clients are manufacturing, but also we have some building facilities, healthcare and hospitals, etc., that are using our solution to maintain their equipment and the infrastructure. Okay. We have also uh, lots of clients into mining and etc. Um, well, so um, the the um, the software fits um, fits some 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 clients that they can have some small medium sized company, but also multi site organization. Um, the solution was really built also for that, so we can really um, be with you onto onto a project, multi site, multi country, multi currency, multi time zone. Okay. Um, the software that uh, I'm talking about is called Demoment MX. Okay, so Demoment MX, it's a full cloud solution. It's scalable, it's integrated with Sage X3. Okay, two days integration with Sage X3, the, the connector is, and the maintenance of the connector is uh, is integrated into the cost. Okay, um, Demoment MX is a standalone software. Okay, it's not within Sage X3, it's a part, but we have a connector pretty straightforward that I'm going to, to explain um, just after that. So the moment mix, it's full cloud, it's hosted on Microsoft Azure, it has the APIs available to integrate not only with X3, but also with all of in your information system. It has a mobile app, iOS Android. This mobile app works without internet connection. In case within the plant or maybe um, depending on where you are doing your maintenance, you can perfectly do it without internet connection and when the internet come back, you can just synchronize, okay? As I was saying, it works multi-language, multi-time zone, multi-currency. The idea is super easy to use and to have the maintenance working with uh, an easy to use software um, that can be mobile and full web, okay? Uh, we already have some clients integrated with X3, uh, a lot uh, here, some example on to the Americas, uh, for example, a lot in, in the food industry, um, but also cannabis industry and others, okay? Uh, at the end of the of this presentation, I'm going to show you some testimonies of clients that are using MX integrated with X3 and what is the added value of using MX uh, integrated, okay? So what is the, the functional scope of the, of the maintenance? Uh, of the moment MX. So first you will be able to have a perfect view all of, of the asset um, available, okay, within the, uh, all of the asset that you have uh, currently into into the firm, for example, okay. So you will be able to to structure them into a tree structure. For, for example, you have uh, maybe various plants, so you can manage it by region in turn to your plant and you have uh, the infrastructure, the production, and you can in turn the production and you have, for example, production line one and all of your assets, okay? You can go as deep as you want. There is no limit on the on the levels. Um, on those assets, so you will have all of the information um, that you need, okay? Um, and then on those assets, you will have some work orders, okay? Those work orders, they can come from work requests, okay? So someone is walking into the plant and see there is a problem specific, maybe specific noise on an asset that is not normal, and he can just raise a request, okay? Um, the requests are freely limited, so you can create as many as you need. On the other end, you have all that is preventive maintenance. So every month, every year, you will have this type of checkup onto the asset. And for sure, conditional maintenance based on measures, counters uh, related to an asset, okay? And for example, when you reach 5,000 kilometers, it will trigger a specific maintenance. Or between, for example, on an asset between 50 and 80 degrees, it's okay, and if it, go up, if it goes up, uh, for example, 90 degrees, it will trigger something, a specific maintenance, okay? Um, this work order we related with who will do it. Do I need an engineer, mechanical, an electrician, or maybe a subcontractor, okay? And for sure, all the parts, um, all the parts, all the consumable, the tools that you would need, okay? You can manage also all that is inventories, alerts, uh, stocks alerts, purchase order, purchase request, and for sure, manage the budget. And all of that, you will have some analysis. Okay, so this is the scope of the moment mix, but for sure it's uh, it integrates with Sage X3. Okay, without entering in too much detail, 
the integration is pretty it's pretty straightforward with we have sagex 3 on one side um sagex 3 has the, ma the master data okay um it will update um at first update to the moment mx uh, all that is uh, cost centers articles and suppliers okay so i am the maintenance guy i can see within uh, within the software all of that information and um, i don't have to go find it into x3 okay i can see all of the suppliers the parts and that they are selling me in this contract if they are subcontractors how much they are costing me etc okay and then um we will integrate on two other uh, part the purchasing and the inventory okay so first in the moment mx when i have I, I see i need more parts of for a specific work order maybe i need i need a specific part to operate i can raise a purchase request okay and this purchase request will be sent to sage x3 um, and into sage x3 you will be able to have your your flow validation transform it to a purchase order reject it etc okay as the maintenance guy so you can raise the purchase request and you can follow up on the purchase request on the purchase order directly within mx you don't have to go to sage x3 to see the status of your purchase request purchase order okay <clears throat> when once your purchase order is okay and you receive the stock it will update directly the stock within mx okay and on the other end um um when you will be working you are the maintenance guy you are working and you are, you are on a specific work order you are consuming some parts it will be it will send a stock movement to x3 okay and for example minus two and it will uh, update the stock within x3 okay so you are, um, you are the maintenance team uh, really you will have all of the information that you need from x3 and all that is the purchase request and the stocks consuming the parts etc you can do it all from mx you don't have to do double entries okay more than x3 um, you can also integrate with the rest of the of your information system you have a scala system you have a super engine system metrology system we can integrate with that okay so you could for example send us and uh, the value of the sensors or, or your equipment the temperatures the counters directly and uh, trigger some condition maintenance like that okay um we can as MX is a standalone, um, it's not integrated within X3, so we are able also with our offices in Toronto and Mexico to 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 help you um, on the project, okay? So we can do it all um, remote, but we can also come to your site with our consultants and we can help you from a very simple project to a multi-site project with project charter, conception, parametrization, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, we can also help you build some more interface. The service center um, through our, um, our offices in Mexico, in the US, um, in Toronto. Uh, we have also all that is customer support directly linked uh, to the software. Okay, um, so you can just raise the request and we'll be on the same time zone as you. Okay, and that is true also if you have operation not only in the US but also in Asia and Europe. Or in Africa, okay. Um, so now some some I'm going to to talk about three testimonies, three three clients of of ours that are using MX um, integrated with uh, Sage X3. Okay. So for example, Bariatrix, and um, they are they are in Canada, and um, they are in the food industry. Okay. They do uh, they do protein rich foods and uh, supplement for weight loss diets. Okay. And um, so they were needing the before the moment they didn't have any maintenance software, okay, but they already had Sage X3 and they needed on the on the maintenance side to, to add methods on the on the maintenance, they they didn't have a view of what were the, the tasks that were doing the 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 guys and if they were doing the, the task uh, really and uh, didn't have any real view on the maintenance team on the spare part management, okay. Um, so so they <clears throat> they went with the moment uh, with the moment and um, so they went with it integrated with x3 the the added value of the integration with x3 it was very first time saving for, for the maintenance team as uh, they don't need to re-enter the data for the purchase order uh, but also for the stocks okay um, and also on the on the management side um, there was no more error 
of uh, of entries between the CMMS and the NX3. Okay. And for sure, the ID. So the real added value also is that XD moment is super easy to use, super easy to apprehend, and and so it was very easy for the maintenance team to have a quick grip on on the solution. That being for the supervisors, but also for the technician with the mobile app. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, another example, so Grand um, Vienna Airport, so this is not manufacturing, they are airports, okay, so they, they manage various airports, various terminals, etc. And a uh, same thing, they needed a, a, a maintenance solution, okay. Um, the specific thing that uh, they were looking at is that they, they were needing some KPIs, some specific KPIs um, that they were not having on the availabilities, on the cost, etc. That that on the maintenance side that they need to to give to to the management. Okay, so this is one one side um, uh, why they were needed uh, needing a maintenance solution. Okay, they were needing also to to manage their subcontractors. Okay, they have uh, 20, 20 contracts with subcontractors, and so the subcontractors were coming to, to the sites and doing some, some works, but they, they didn't have any visibilities on the works, on the time they were passing within the, the sites, and if the works was done, were, were done well, etc. And they were needing a, a definition, a real definition of the assets and the maintenance level on the assets, uh, depending on the criticality, okay? Um, so that's why they, they went to with the moment MX and the connector with X3, it helped them to, to have a, a better management first of, of the spare parts, okay? Um, they have very small stocks and they really need um, a, a nearly just in time inventories, okay? So they don't have big stock with a lot of parts. So they, they need really a, a good view of, of the stocks. And so that's why the maintenance team, they need to, to be integrated with X3 to have a, a, a real management of that, okay? Um, it helped them also to 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 get better uh, because they they want to 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 optimize and get a lean management strategy onto onto those airports. And for sure, uh, on the fan side, um, they were glad to to have a maintenance software integrated to X3 to have the view of all the costs directly into X3 also, and to have all the the parts, the stocks, etc. Respecting the same nomenclature um, that they have established um, in in X3. <clears throat> And um, to end with the testimonies, another example, it's uh, Sockfin. So Sockfin is a, is a really big firm based in, in Luxembourg and they operate uh, in, uh, in a lot of country. Um, they do, they, they produce some palm oil and, and rubber. Um, and so they didn't have, so they are based in Luxembourg, but they have the operation a bit all over the world in Asia and Africa, etc. cetera. Um, so first they needed, a maintenance digitalized to have a view, a group view of uh, of this activity, and to have a group um, solution. So the the software needed to to be <clears throat> in various time zone, various currencies, and a various languages. No, so that's why MX was a good fit. And they needed, uh, they had a real need on monitoring the equipment availabilities, and uh, to manage the maintenance budget. Um, and so with X3, the added value um, with X3 and MX, the added value of notable entries <clears throat> on the on the stocks, on the purchase order, etc. And um, the user could see all of the repositories, so all of the stocks on the different sites. Okay, so that was important because maybe I'm the maintenance team on the site one, and I I like a, a part. Maybe it's quicker to ask the part to 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 the other site than other one. Okay, so this way, the maintenance team within MX, they have, they have uh, also this, this type of 